Copying text from an image is super easy on iOS and macOS thanks to Apple's marvelous live text feature. And Google has a similarly excellent app on Android called Google Lens. Then of course there's good old Windows which sadly lacks any such feature, but there is a workaround which I'll demonstrate a little bit later on. However, we'll start with iPhone and macOS and work our way through. Time tags are in the description below if you want to skip ahead to Android or Windows, so let's get started. With the release of iOS 15 and macOS Monterey, Apple introduced live text. On iPhone and iPad, this means that you can point your camera at anything with text and this icon will appear. It's worth noting you don't actually have to take the photo to be able to copy the text. If you don't see this icon, head over to settings, click on camera and make sure show detected text is enabled. Click on the icon to grab the text from the image. Now it's just a simple matter of selecting and copying the text and pasting it somewhere else, like in your notes app, for example. You can even get really geeky and take it one step further using Handoff, which enables you to take the text you copied on your iPhone and paste it on your Mac like so. The copy text feature on iPhone is also really useful for grabbing specific information such as someone's contact details, like the details of this real estate agent in my newspaper. Click on the icon to grab the text as per normal and iOS automatically recognizes that it's a mobile number and email address. From here I can quickly dial the number or send the person a message or I can click the email address to send them an email. Live text works just as well for photos you've already taken and saved to your photos app. You'll see the same icon as before and you can grab the text from the image in exactly the same way either by selecting the text or if it's contact details like a phone number you'll get the same options to call the number or send them a message. Just bear in mind live text is only available on iPhone XS and XR onwards. With macOS Monterey Apple extended their live text feature to the desktop. Now in the Photos or Preview app, you'll notice the cursor changes when hovering over text, allowing you to simply select the text you want and copy and paste it into another app, like so. As with iPhone, if the text relates to contact details, you'll notice a little drop down arrow to the right of the text, providing you with additional options such as calling, FaceTiming or messaging the mobile number, or creating a new email if the text is an email address. If the text is a URL, you can open it in Safari. Live text also works exactly the same way on images you find in Safari. You can simply select the text or again click on the drop down menu for different options. Where iPhone has live text, Android has Google Lens. Google Lens works in a very similar way to live text. You can activate it in several ways, either by opening the Google Lens app or if you're in the camera app, you can click on modes or you can just long press on the screen. Having activated Google Lens, you'll notice the menu along the bottom of the screen offers several different options and features like the ability to translate or search the internet using the text. However, for a simple copy paste, we'll click on the text followed by select all and copy text. We can then paste the text into different apps such as Google Notes like so. As with iPhone's live text, Google Lens also recognizes when the text includes contact details and automatically offers you some options such as composing an email to the email address or going to the associated website. You can of course just copy the text as we did already with the image taken from the book. If you already took the photo, open your Photos app and you'll see a prompt to copy the text or you can choose Google Lens from the menu. Either way, you will open the image in Google Lens, giving you exactly the same options as before. As I said at the beginning of the video, sadly Windows, to my knowledge, doesn't offer any similar built-in features. The best solution I could find was to install a free app from the Microsoft Store called Photoscan. Download the app and once installed, click on Open. Then it's simply a matter of dragging your image onto the app window like so. 
The text will appear on the right of the window and you can see that you may need to fix up a few mistakes before you can copy and paste it into another application. So that is how to copy text from an image across all platforms. If you found the video useful, I'd appreciate you giving me a like and hitting subscribe for lots more useful tips and tricks. And you may also be interested in finding out how you can search the internet using an image and my five recommended free security apps to safeguard your privacy. Until next time, my name is Anthony. Thank you very much for watching.